So we started in March of 2013, and uh, you know the the school and I came up with the idea of, of running 2014 miles because we're going to be we were going to be completing the school in 2014. So how do your feet feel? Uh, they're a little sore. They're a little sore. I think after this first thing is probably going to be a massage, uh, but uh, no, it's it's been well worth it. You know, we, you look at the great facility that we have that now really matches the talent that we have to really help these, uh, these kids, and it's, uh, it's just a great feeling. On your blog, oneinspiredidiot.com, you mentioned running some, uh, through some pretty tough conditions, both in weather and location. Uh, what kind of challenges did you face and what motivated you to keep going? Well, there were a lot of challenges. So we ran in everything from snow to, uh, to heat. Uh, there was rainy days when you just don't want to get out of bed and, and go, but really just continuing to think about the struggles that the kids have to go through and the fact that you know this is tiny compared to what they face every day and that's what got me up and got me out of bed every morning. Uh, so for people like me who don't exactly see themselves running 2014 miles, um, how can other people make an impact at Southside? Well the good news is you don't have to run that far. Um, you know, we've got a lot of ways that, that uh, anybody who's interested can help, whether it's coming down and volunteering, volunteering your time, volunteering your money, um, and, uh, and really just anything that you can do to help these kids is gonna make their lives better and it's gonna give them a much better chance at a future. So now that you've crossed the finish line, uh, what's next for One Inspired Idiot? Um, you know, good question. I think uh, I've, I've actually still got a couple of races uh, coming up between now and the end of the year, so I'm still running. Uh, but I, I want to expand what we talk about. So, you know, the the blog and and uh, and we're also on Twitter at oneinspiredidiot.com. So, having a combination of just talking about the running, but also really expanding people's knowledge about what goes on here at Southside and all the great work that that happens here and really hoping to, to, to give just some more of those stories to, uh, to the rest of the world and, uh, and help them understand what a special place this is. Tim, thank you so much. Great, thank you.